had a game this season with so many prime scoring chances. Is that, I know you can't keep living on chances and close calls, but does that reaffirm that you're heading in the right direction? Do you, is that your takeaway from this game, the way you played tonight? Uh, offensively, I thought um, after the first few minutes of the game, where, I mean, it yeah. was a struggle those first few minutes. But then I thought we started uh, playing with pace. Uh, I thought we moved the puck well. Um, hated the second period defensively. Hated how we defended in the second period. Hated how soft we were in the second period defensively. But we did some. And then the other end, we, we played really well offensively. Uh, but we just, we can't defend that way, the, the period in that second period. We, we cannot defend that way. Um, a lot of good things, but there's still a lot of things that we have to corral uh, um, away from the puck. Yeah, I'll, I'll, I'll put it to you that way. Corpusalo was um, out of his mind tonight with that with his stick. This could have been, I guess, four nothing, four one before you got started. How impressed were you by his play tonight? Yeah, he played good. Yeah, he didn't like that first goal. Is that was that a bother to you as well? It's a lousy goal. Yeah. All right. Thanks. Next, we'll go to Dave Metzl. Go ahead, Metzi. John, you moved uh, uh, Lanny over to the right side tonight. How do you think he did over there, and did it help him at all? I don't know if that helped him moving over there. He certainly played better. Uh, he was certainly uh, skating with the puck, going north. Uh, was strong in the puck. I thought he, I thought a lot of our guys played uh, uh, really well. I thought we made a lot of plays, uh, had a lot of good looks, fanned on open nets, hit posts on open nets, uh, uh, had a number of chances, uh, just didn't finish. Um, so if we can just, if we can fix uh, some of the things. Uh, in the second period, as far as how many, I mean, we gave them 10 scoring chances in the second period. If we, and it's an easy fix, it's just a little bit of commitment and, and still, and, and allow ourselves to play with the confidence we had with the puck tonight, then I think we're heading down the right road. You also had Riley Nash centering that line. How do you think he fit in well there with, uh, with Patrick and Oliver? I, I like the lines. I like the lines. Didn't like Jack. I, I don't think Jack competed hard enough, so we kind of moved things around there in the third period. Uh, I'm hoping Jack uh, understands how hard we have to play. Um, but I, I, for the most part, I liked our lines tonight. I thought Tex took a big step tonight as far as wanting the puck and carrying the puck. Um, yeah, I'm. It's frustrating. You get you don't get a result. Uh, you don't get any result. Um, but. We got to we got to stay with it. We got to allow it to play. Uh, uh, we we just need to have a little bit more commitment in our end zone as far as our battles. Thanks. Next, we'll go to Jacob Myers. Go ahead, Jacob. John, you mentioned the second period a little bit, and he started that period on the power play, and didn't get much out of it, and. I thought the penalty kill at the end of the period was good, but obviously they score on it. I guess were, were those kind of the two big moments when you think about this game that uh, really you want to have back a bit? Yeah, we needed to kill. We needed we needed to finish that kill. Um, yeah, I'd like to get another save there on that on the third goal. I, I know it'd be a good save, but I'd like we'd like to get another save there um, to help us. But. Um, we didn't. T too many, you know, it's a, you take a couple offensive zone penalties and it's hard to, those are hard ones to kill off. And uh, um, so, you know, again, I'm, I'm not, I'm looking for anything to grab a hold of for these guys in a pause away. And there was a lot of positives tonight. Don't get me wrong here, guys, but we, uh, things that we can control with commitment uh, was was very frustrating for me in the second period. And uh, then I thought we, we, we played a really good third period. So I, a lot of good minutes, but there's still some things to be cleaned up. Is there anything with that third period effort more than just guys having some more bite, some more hunger that maybe you want to have more consistency out of? I'm, I'm not sure what you're asking me. 
I, I guess, is it anything but just the guys, I guess, having more drive and, and more hunger in the third period? Um, anything kind of, I guess, tactically that you want to have replicated throughout the game? Or is it just their kind of commitment um, that you saw there in the third period? Yeah, I, I think it's the willingness to make plays. Uh, I, I think we did that for the most part. Do you, t do you take out... Uh, the beginning of the game where it was a major struggle for us and then we started skating uh, Second period th and, and this is where you, you kind of have to live with it We turned the puck over a little bit uh, in the neutral zone four or five uh, pretty big turnovers But you know, you, you can't talk out of both sides of your mouth either. You wanted to make some plays and uh, There were some plays that got batted down uh, That turned the other way where Corpy had to come up big for us but I want us to have the confidence and, and, and the courage to make plays and not always be dumping pucks in. And uh, I think it bit us a little bit in that second period. Third period, I thought we played well, uh, had some looks, had some looks through the game where, uh, where we had, you know, there, there's a net there. It, and we just can get it done. Bob played good. Bob played a good game. I thought both goalies played really well.